Welcome back to the mini series, Cooking Up the Season. This series highlights in-season food found at local farmers markets, farm stands, and grocery stores. I am Regina Mosley, Family and Consumer Sciences Agent with North Carolina Cooperative Extension serving Nash and Edgecombe counties. Today, our focus is on bell peppers. Bell peppers are fat-free, low in sodium, cholesterol-free, low in calories, and high in vitamin C. Bell peppers are in season in North Carolina from June to September. When selecting peppers, choose firm, brightly colored peppers with tight skin. You want them to feel heavy for their size. You need to avoid dull, shriveled, or pitted peppers. Refrigerate the peppers in a plastic bag for use within five days. Bell peppers can be frozen without blanching. Select crisp, tender, green, or bright red pods. Wash and cut the peppers in half, removing stems, seeds, and the white membrane. Cut into one half inch strips, rings, or dice depending upon your use. Place in freezer bag or a store freezer container, seal, and freeze. Bell peppers are very versatile. They can be used as a colorful side. You can stuff them, dice them for a salad, or use them on a pizza. You can add them to stir fry. They can be added to wraps and sandwiches and they can be roasted on the grill or you can just slice them up and eat them for a healthy snack. Here is a simple recipe for stuffed bell peppers. You will need four large bell peppers, one half cup of white rice, salt and pepper to taste, one small onion chopped, a 14 and a half ounce can of diced tomatoes, six ounce tomato paste, and one pound of grand ground beef browned, and you could omit that if you want a vegetarian style. Slice tops off of peppers and carefully remove seeds and the inner ribs. Remove stems from tops and chop the remaining pepper pieces. Stand the peppers upright in a baking dish. In a bowl, combine the browned ground beef, chopped pepper tops, rice, onion, salt, pepper, and one fourth cup of diced tomatoes. Mix well. Stuff the peppers with the mixture. Mix remaining tomatoes and tomato paste until well blended. Pour the mixture over and around peppers in baking dish. Cover with aluminum foil and bake 30 minutes at 350 degrees Fahrenheit or until the peppers are tender. You can top your peppers with cheddar cheese if you prefer. Thank you for participating in the eighth lesson of the Cooking Up the Season mini series. For more information on bell peppers, contact Regina Mosley at regina underscore mosley at ncsu.edu.